Ever pondered on the unusual notion of Earth, our home, being shaped differently? Picture this. Our planet not as the familiar blue sphere we know and love, but as something entirely different. Imagine Earth molded into shapes as curious as a donut, as peculiar as a dumbbell, or as controversial as a flat disk. Such a twist would be far from trivial, for the shape of Earth is the cornerstone of life as we know it. It's responsible for the gravitational pull that keeps us grounded, and the atmospheric conditions that allow us to breathe. Each shift from the spherical model would induce a shift in these forces, affecting everything from our weight to the climate. What if our planet was a donut, with fluctuating gravity levels stirring up colossal storms? Or a dumbbell, two separate entities connected by a thin bridge, leading to extreme volcanic activity and potential planet breakage? Fascinating, isn't it? So, let's embark on a journey through these alternative Earth contours, each presenting its unique challenges and opportunities. Imagine a world shaped like your favorite breakfast treat, a donut. Yes, you heard that right, a donut-shaped Earth. Bizarre as it may sound, it's a concept that's been toyed with by scientists and dreamers alike. Now let's delve into this delectable scenario. The Earth, instead of being a perfect sphere, is shaped like a scrumptious donut, complete with a hole in the middle. Imagine the sun rising and setting through that hole, creating a captivating spectacle of light and shadow. But don't let the sweet imagery fool you. Living on a donut-shaped Earth would come with its fair share of challenges. The most significant of these would be fluctuating gravity levels. On a spherical Earth, gravity is pretty much the same everywhere, but on a donut Earth, not so much. Gravity would be strongest at the equator of the donut, where the Earth is thickest and weakest at the inner and outer edges. These varying gravity levels could lead to some extreme weather patterns. For starters, we could expect massive hurricanes and storms. The pull of gravity affects the movement of air and water, so with varying gravity, we could see weather patterns unlike anything we're used to. Let's not forget the oceans. With different gravity levels water wouldn't be evenly distributed. The oceans could be deeper in some areas and shallower in others. Who knows, we might even have a massive waterfall plunging into the hole in the middle of our donut earth. And what about life as we know it? Life has evolved to survive under our planet's current gravity. A change in gravity could have drastic effects on all life forms, from the smallest microbes to the largest animals. Living on a donut-shaped Earth would be no piece of cake, with its unique weather patterns and gravity fluctuations. It's a fascinating thought experiment though and one that makes us appreciate the perfectly imperfect sphere we call home. What about a world shaped like a fitness enthusiast's tool of choice? A dumbbell. Imagine two Earth-sized globes tethered together by a narrow middle section, spinning in the void of space. This is the concept of a dumbbell-shaped Earth, a fantastical configuration that would drastically alter life as we know it. In this peculiar setup, the middle section connecting the two planets would be a hotbed for volcanic activity. The constant spinning of the two globes would generate immense internal heat, leading to the formation of a magma-filled conduit. Picture the most extreme volcanoes you've ever seen, and then amplify their power tenfold, such is the potential of this dumbbell Earth. The gravitational forces at play would also be extremely unique. At the narrow middle section, gravity would be at its weakest, resulting in a low-gravity environment. This could potentially allow for easier transportation between the two globes. Meanwhile, the surface of the globes would experience higher gravity, pulling everything towards them. However, the dumbbell configuration presents a looming risk, the potential for the planet to break apart. The constant spinning motion and the intense gravitational forces could put immense strain on the narrow middle section. Over time, this could lead to the planet tearing itself apart, resulting in two separate globes hurtling through space. Living conditions on a dumbbell-shaped Earth would be drastically different from our current globe. The extreme volcanic activity could create a hostile environment, with frequent eruptions altering the landscape and climate. Adapting to these conditions would be a challenge, requiring resilience, innovation, and a deep understanding of this unusual planetary configuration. Despite these challenges, the Dumbbell Earth also presents fascinating opportunities for exploration. The unique gravitational conditions could unlock new possibilities for travel and scientific discovery. The extreme environments could push the boundaries of our understanding of life and survival in the cosmos. Surviving on a dumbbell-shaped Earth would be a constant balancing act with its own set of geological and climatic challenges. A world that pushes the limits of imagination, the dumbbell Earth is a testament to the incredible diversity of potential planetary configurations. 
And then, there's the theory that has intrigued many, a flat Earth. A concept that has been around for centuries long before the round Earth was universally accepted. This theory posits that our planet is not a sphere, but instead a flat plane. It is a thought that might seem outlandish in the modern era. But, let's explore this further. A flat Earth would mean a complete reimagining of our understanding of gravity. Instead of pulling everything towards the center, gravity would pull straight down. This would make climbing a mountain for instance a significantly different experience. As you ascend, you would not lean into the mountain, but remain perpendicular to the ground, making the climb more strenuous and disorienting. Another fascinating aspect to consider is the climate. On a spherical Earth the climate is determined by the angle at which sunlight hits the surface. However on a flat Earth the sun would either have to be very close and small, or its light would have to bend in unusual ways. This could result in a planet with a single, uniform climate or perhaps a world with wildly unpredictable weather patterns. Navigational systems would also need a total overhaul. Our current methods rely on the Earth's spherical shape to determine the shortest and quickest routes. A flat Earth would mean rethinking our entire approach to travel. Imagine for instance a flight from New York to Beijing. On a round Earth, the quickest path is a great circle route arching up over the Arctic. On a flat Earth however this would no longer be the case. It's important to note that the scientific consensus supports a round Earth, backed by a wealth of evidence from various fields of study. However the idea of a flat Earth serves as an interesting thought experiment, pushing us to question our understanding of the world and its natural phenomena. Navigating life on a flat Earth would be a journey like no other filled with unique challenges and opportunities. All these different shapes, each with its unique set of challenges and opportunities, but what does it mean for life as we know it? The shape of the Earth, it turns out, is not just a random choice made by the universe, but a critical factor that influences every aspect of our existence. It's the reason you're not floating off into space right now, the reason we have seasons, and the reason we have a diverse range of climates and ecosystems. Imagine a donut-shaped Earth. In the center of this torus structure we would have zero gravity due to the equal pull from all sides. This would create a central band of weightlessness, potentially causing chaos with weather patterns, leading to massive hurricanes and storms. Living in such an environment would be a constant struggle against the elements. On the other hand, a dumbbell-shaped Earth, consisting of two separate planets connected by a narrow middle section, would present a different set of challenges. The extreme gravitational pull at the connecting section might lead to intense volcanic activity, threatening the stability of the entire planet. Survival here would not just be about braving the elements but also about navigating a landscape that's prone to violent, geological upheavals. And what about a flat Earth? The gravity would be strongest at the center and gradually decrease towards the edges. This would result in a drastic variation in climates with the center being extremely hot due to the concentrated gravity and the edges freezing due to the lack of it. Life would have to adapt to these extreme conditions, leading to a wide range of unique species and ecosystems. So, it's not just about the shape, but about the effects that the shape has on gravity, climate, and ultimately, life. Each shape would present its own unique challenges for survival and exploration. It makes one appreciate the beautifully balanced sphere that we call home. Our Earth's shape, it seems, is more than just a sphere, it's a life-supporting design. So now that we've journeyed through these alternative Earth shapes, what have we learned? The shape of our world is not just an aesthetic feature, it's a crucial determinant of the conditions under which life can and does exist. The gravitational forces that we take for granted, the stability of our climate, even the very feasibility of life, all hinge on the Earth being a sphere. Imagine a donut-shaped Earth, with its fluctuating gravity levels giving rise to monstrous storms, or a dumbbell Earth, its two halves connected by a slender middle, prone to volcanic activity and the constant threat of splitting apart. Even a flat Earth, while seemingly simple, would greatly complicate navigation and the cycle of day and night. These alternative shapes present us with fascinating thought experiments and underscore the importance of Earth's spherical shape. Next time you look at a map or a globe, remember, the shape of our world is more than just a design, it's a blueprint for life.